if you lose that playoff game at Westlake tomorrow, football is done at Crenshaw. Tonight's game is the most important game of the year. It's personal. Know what's at stake. All are built for this. Let's go! What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you love All-American, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, like the video, and leave your theories, comments, everything down below. Now, today, we're going to be talking about All-American, Season 3, Episode 14. This is the What to Expect video for Episode 14, and this is based off the trailer that they put out. Now, make sure you check out my Episode 13 recap that i dropped a couple days ago man that episode was crazy your girl olivia she went through it and what we learned in that episode was of course that crenshaw is still in the hunt they still have a chance um you know as far as playing football because that's a good thing because we know episode a few episodes ago uh, they forfeited and you know their season was pretty much over but in this next episode they're about to be going up against West Lake, and that's the same team that has Dane on there and Cam. So we're definitely going to talk about that because it's about to go down, man. Everybody's been talking about they wanted to see football. Well, this is the episode that football is going to return in full effect, in my opinion, and we're going to see it. Um, now, like I said, you guys let me know what you th thought about the trailer. If I miss anything, let me know down below. Now, Coach Baker, he's going to be going through it because he knows he has to win. And as his pops is telling him, if you lose to Westlake, football in Crenshaw High School is just, it's playing out over. You know what I'm saying? It is over. So now he has his pops on him. And to be honest, Billy, he needs that pressure. He needs that pressure um, that his pops is putting on him because Billy's going to take this same motivation, this same pressure that he has, and he's going to put that on his players, which I believe they already know what time it is. This is a very personal game the title of the episode is called ready or not so these guys are gonna have to be ready to play go out there and deliver this ain't the game that you got to go out there and lose trust me spencer knows this in the trailer we see in spencer and you already know when he had this look on his face that means something is up he is worried about something um all i'm gonna say is this hopefully your boy spencer can come out there and dominate um but he's gonna need the help of all his teammates it can't just be spencer He's going to need everybody on that team to step up, which I believe they will do. And, of course, Coach Baker will be giving the boys a speech, telling them the consequences, telling them probably that he's proud of them for what they did, that they kept fighting. And now this is the time that they've been waiting on to go out there and play football and to win, to continue their journey, to hopefully make it to state. So we're going to see if that's going to happen. As I said, this game is personal. We know that these scouts is going to be out there. Um, them going up against Cam's team is definitely something that your boy Spencer's probably been waiting on. Deep down inside, he knew this was going to happen. Now, in this trailer, we see Dane and Cam. And they're in the high school laughing and, you know what I'm saying, joking. But they're walking past, which seems to me, looks like your boy Jordan in the same hallway. And we already know that Dane, he is the one that gave Jordan that concussion. So in the back of Jordan's head, he's like, man, here are these guys again. You know what I'm saying? Last time I saw these guys, um, I got knocked unconscious. And that was very, you know, personal. This game is very personal. So I know Jordan, he wants to get revenge. But I believe that Crenshaw, they're going to have to go out there and seek that revenge and deliver. These guys have been running a mouth. Cam has been running his mouth since day one about how he's a beast. Well, we're going to see in this game exactly what's going to happen. Also in the trailer, we saw your girl Coop. Now she's going to a, a grave site. And if I had to guess, maybe it's Sean. She's probably going to visit, you know, pay her respects. That's what I think because it bets not be Tyrone. That's all I got to say. Hey, I, you know, I doubt it's him, but it makes more sense to go and see Sean because we know how close they were. My question is, where is Mo? We didn't see her in the last episode. I got a feeling she's going to pop back up. And seeing that Preach was not on the same program as her, that means she's going to try a new route to get Coop. The question is, what is it? Then we see Olivia. And remember in the last episode, Olivia was being targeted. She was being followed by the boys. And in this episode, as I told you, she's going to continue to be a target. They know what she did. 
It's going to be people that's going to go out there and challenge her. So I will expect your girl Olivia to adapt, to be able to respond better and to handle these situations. On another note, I will say hopefully Olivia and Layla, they can click up or whatever because it seems like Layla has a new friend. When we talked about Carrie um, and that can be a major issue. So we're going to see how this all plays out, but I hope your girl Olivia is able to push through in this episode because he seems like she's definitely going through it. Now, based off this trailer alone, it does seem like Crenshaw is going to be down, that Crenshaw is going to be struggling against Westlake. And this is something that they don't want to do. But to be honest with you guys, we've seen this team struggle a lot. And in, in trailer, we see seeing Dane and, you know, Cam, they celebrating, you know, probably thinking they're going to win the game. So it lets me know, which I believe they will be dominating. So hopefully Spencer, he can rally this team together. Coach Baker, they can push all this together and come out with the victory. But it would not be an easy win. It would not be an easy game at all for these guys. As I told you, this is a personal game. This is something that Spencer knew deep down the side would happen eventually. And I know he does not want to lose to Cam. On this stage, he don't want to go down for this. So the pressure is on him once again because he's probably looking like, okay, not only do I have to beat this team, I promise this school that I will try to get them, get them back to the state. Um, and also, he wants to get revenge on Cam, and he probably wants to get revenge for his boy, Jordan, because that's what I will be thinking. Like, okay, I got to get revenge. These guys are dirty. We know that Dane, he ain't nothing. Um, so I got to go out there and deliver. I'm glad that the football will be coming back. I will say this is the most football that we saw in the trailer in a long time, because I know his fans out there saying they've been waiting for the football to return. Well, from the looks of it, from the looks of this trailer, it definitely seems like football will be returning. Um, and we're going to see how far these guys are going to go. That would be crazy if Crenshaw ends up losing, right? If they lose, they done for, right? You know what I'm saying? So that would be crazy. If they fought all this time, you know, they canceled the season for them, pretty much forfeited the season, and then they got a chance to get, get brought back in, and then they lose to Westlake. I mean, how will Spencer deal with that? He won't be able to, man. It's going to take some time for him to get through that. So I'm expecting him to go out there and do what he got to do. But you guys let me know, man, based on what you saw in this trailer, what do you think is going to happen? Um, I will be doing some videos because we got to June 14th. June 14th. Damn, another break. But we'll get there, man. Like I said, I will be dropping some more All-American videos for you guys. And then when we get a little bit closer to episode 14, I will be dropping that final predictions video for you guys as well. But thank you guys for all the love, all the support, and I will catch y'all on the next one. But it's your boy Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.